Good morning, everybody. Uh, happy Tuesday. Welcome to our daily dose of Success God's Way. This is Erin Harrigan, your Hustle with Heart and Health Coach, helping everyone attain lifetime results for total health with Arbon and helping entrepreneurs align results to God's truth. So I've been coming to you most recently from this book, Discerning the Voice of God by Priscilla Schreier. She's one of my very favorite authors. And last night, in case you missed it, our weekly dose was focused on um, five steps to take uh, to discern the voice of God, which is from this book. So I hope you'll get over to Success God's Way and watch that weekly dose video. It, it will be a future podcast episode. So if you haven't gotten over to AaronHarrigan.com to subscribe so you can not miss any podcasts or blogs, definitely encourage you to do that. But one thing that came up for me in this book uh, in the last few days is what are we seeking? So while we are certainly learning to discern the voice of God as God-centered entrepreneurs, we spend a lot of time seeking his will and his direction. And, and we talk about that. When I work with my Hustle with Heart coaches, that's one of the things that we talk about is consistent time in the word, consistent time getting to know the Lord. And in doing so, learning his character and his patterns and what it's like to hear from him. But one thing that Priscilla brought up that I think is so valuable for all of us is to not lose sight of the fact that what we really need to be seeking first and foremost is our relationship with him. Let us not forego the seeking of our relationship with the Lord for the seeking of the Lord's direction. And it, it was a little nuance that sprung up for me as I was reading over the weekend and thinking about when I'm spending time with the Lord, when we've talked about this before, am I spending more time talking at the Lord and asking for things? Or am I relishing in my time with him to build my relationship with him? Because you guys, the only way we can hear from him uh, and and get a sense of where he's taking us and what he wants us to do is to first know him. We have to know him. We have to know his character. We have to get to know his patterns. Um, we have to get to know who he is and how and and get to trust and know that when he says he'll never leave us or forsake us and that we can be strong and of good courage and that his power is made strong in our weakness and that he does go out before us and he does work all things together for our good and he creates beauty from ashes. The only way to really know those things is to get to know him first. So I want to encourage you today to just think about when you're seeking his direction, have you sought him first? And I also want to highly recommend this book. Um, so it's Discerning the Voice of God by Priscilla Schreier. And by the way, all of my coaching clients in 2020 are getting a copy of this book. And I have room for eight, two per quarter next year. So I'd love to chat with you if you need an ally um, and you just need some help digging into this idea of hustle with heart and pursuing success his way. I'd love to chat with you about that. If I can support you in your health journey um, to better health, better mental clarity, better energy, better sleep, I'd love to chat with you about that. And as always, get down below. Let me know how this idea of seeking him, truly him first, not just his direction and his will, resonates with you. And get on over to our Success God's Way community as well. I'd love to welcome you over there. And with that, I wish you guys a fantastic Tuesday, and I'll see you tomorrow for the Daily Dose. See ya.